San Antonio Spurs. They have the 17-11 lead, and Tim Duncan 0 for 10 from the field. Fox lost it. Well, that first quarter was a quarter. If Tim Duncan did anything, they would have had a bigger lead, and they've got to get him going, being defended by Robert Orr. Duncan able to go glass for his first field goal. That last shot. Here's Ori rejected by Duncan. We're going to see what the outside shot is going and then concentrate on keeping him in front all the time. Now they want to pick and roll Duncan and Tony Parker, but Tim Duncan is aiming the ball. That's why he's missing now. Here's Parker. Patterson. Oh, it's Duncan able to follow the play and put it down with a minute and a half remaining in what has been a very strange first half. Duncan off the fake, going at O'Neal, and scores! For them, and a big chance for him with this possession. Beautiful pass. Oh, Rose oh. had the shot tip, and it's Duncan who has been very active these last... They have never led. It's been San Antonio throughout. They've led by as many as 10. Duncan is fouled. Foul committed by Walker. That is his second, so Tim Duncan... Played by Medvedenko, back for Parker. Duncan on the rebound, and a foul is called. Oh, Horry not expecting that pass. And here comes Duncan, leading Rose. A oh, beautiful pass on the hop thrown by Tim Duncan. So it's Parker and Daniels now, the guards pulling up front with Rose. And Duncan, Duncan being guarded by Ori with help from George, who came from the blind side to commit the foul. Good job by San Antonio to get it right into Tim Duncan. Uh, help the Sacramento with that physical play. Dallas was not ready for it. Duncan with a power move. 18 points. Pressure shift to Kobe Bryant. He has the luxury of always being under that big umbrella that Shaq provides. Go right at Kobe. They should isolate him with Antonio Daniels because he is bending over. He can't use that leg right now. Duncan. And a foul is called. The crowd reacts. Here comes Shaquille O'Neal. 30 feet from the hoop. Duncan. Going glass, and that's the first successful angle shot that we have seen Tim Duncan hit. Taking command down the stretch, they now lead 76-71. It's their biggest lead of the game. Now look at there are three guys on Tim Duncan, somebody else in black. And Smith comes back from downtown. And equally as important has been his defense on Duncan. He's forcing Duncan to his right for his jumper. On that left box, Tim, he wants to go to his left. Duncan remaining on the floor. Robert Ory all over Steve Smith, not allowing the three. Duncan lays it home. Ten seconds to go. It's an 84-80.